Hi, my name is Kasim, pronounced like awesome, but with a K. And today I'm sharing a super simple, super summery recipe in partnership with Jam Jar. If you don't know, now you know. This is a four ingredient rib recipe. It's sweet, it's savory, it's everything you want in any meal. And it only takes an hour and 45 to two hours to get the ribs super succulent, super juicy, fall off the bone tender. And while you're baking, you can drink some jam jar. So I am pouring my first glass of wine, as you should too. I'm drinking the sweet white. It's my go-to. We're using four tablespoons of brown sugar, one tablespoon of turmeric, and two packets of saison. That's probably the easiest way to get your hands on akiyote. We're gonna mix this all together and we're gonna have our spice mix. But be warned, turmeric will stain your fingers, so use gloves if you don't want that to happen. And voila, that is our spice mix. We're going to rub that onto our ribs. This would be sufficient for a half rack of ribs. Oh, hey, don't mind me. I am having a quick glass of wine. This is a crucial step to making any good recipe great. Hydration. Hydration, guys. Stay hydrated. Mm, that's good. Once you're all done lathering up your ribs with the spice rub, it should look a little bit like that. Really red in color, almost orangey. Then you're just going to wrap it really tight in aluminum foil and we're going to throw it in the oven at 350 degrees for one and a half hours. I say wrap it in aluminum foil, I really mean wrap it tight. And that is going to ensure that all of that moisture, all of that heat is trapped in so you get the most tender result possible. So while the ribs are baking, go do something. Run an errand, do some laundry, have some more jam jar. Cheers. This is what your ribs are gonna look like. Be careful because it's gonna be super steamy. It's gonna have that nice orange and red color, but we have one more step. So we're going to put this back in the oven on broil for two to three minutes to allow the sugar to really caramelize and add a nice crust to the rib. Have you hydrated yet? Because I am hydrating again, so. Mm. Does anyone else close their eyes when they drink wine or is that just me watching? I broiled my ribs on high for about a minute just to get that nice char, really add that crispiness to the outside. Bam ribs table for one if you're extra like me and have a butane torch at home you can char it up 